What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are not fishing today as you can see. This episode is focused on sharing with you the top 10 must-have add-ons for my Pelican Mustang 100 uh, kayak. So let's go ahead and get started. The Pelican Mustang series is one of the most versatile and highly maneuverable sit-in kayak out there in the market. Right off the shelf, it weighs about 39 pounds. It does have a maximum capacity of 300 pounds. This 10-foot kayak or 10-feet kayak uh, comes with an exopod. It's a small rear container that is zippered. This can contain or at least hold uh, some of the stuff that uh, you'll bring with you out in the lake. It also comes with two mounted fish holders on the rear of the kayak. So if you have uh, any fishing rods available, uh, only you can only have two of them neatly placed at the back of your kayak. Let's go ahead and go through my top 10 list of must-have add-ons on Mustang 100 series kayak. Number 10 is the trolling motor. As you all know, paddling can be very difficult, especially on your arm. So if you are someone who would like to fish and go out in the lake and have greater range, I would advise you to have a trolling motor installed on your kayak. Whether it's an 18 pound thrust or 24 pound thrust trolling motor, I think having one will really help make your kayak, fishing kayak experience much more pleasurable. Number nine, kayak lights. You can buy inexpensive kayak lights from Amazon or your favorite uh, sporting goods store and uh, have that installed on your kayak. This is very much helpful, especially if you like fishing at night. Without any lights, it is very dangerous to be out in the water. It allows for boaters to know that there is a vessel close by. So having a kayak lighting or rig, or having your kayak rigged with uh, these lights will definitely be a life saver. Number eight, having a towel or a sponge will also be helpful when you're out in the lake. As you know, there could be water coming inside of the kayak either from the wakes of the boat or from all the fish that you're catching. So having a towel or a sponge will help dry that up or at least clean the mess that fishing can often make. So number eight in my list is a towel or a sponge. Number seven, having an extra rod holder. You know, as I mentioned in, at the beginning, you will have two mounted rod holders on your Pelican Mustang kayak. Having an extra one is also helpful and, and it's very handy uh, to have one in front of you at least. If you love to go out and use a lot of you know, fishing rods, then having an extra rod holder can also come in very handy. Number six, an anchor. There are also inexpensive anchors out there uh, online. I suggest that if you like going out in the lake where the water can be deep and when the situation uh, in the lake can be very busy at times with other boats, uh, the boats and other vessels could cause you know these large wakes. You want to make sure that 
uh, you maintain your position, especially if you find a fishing hole um, in the area. So having an anchor will keep you in the same place for the most part. Not having one can be very catastrophic. Um, so number six in my list is an anchor. Number five, a transducer arm. So if you have a fish finder, you need to have a transducer arm to mount your transducer to it. Um, I've tried mounting my transducer inside of the kayak, but unfortunately, it doesn't emit those sound waves properly when it is inside of the kayak. So having the transducer mounted outside when it's hitting that water or at least when it's under the water it helps locate the fish that you are trying to catch so having a transducer arm is very helpful number four is a fish finder you can have any fish finder that you would like there are inexpensive ones. What I have is a Hummingbird Piranha uh, series fish finder, and that alone does so well. I could not go out of the lake without the fish finder with me. Uh, it does help me navigate my way, locate the fish out in the water, and it also allows me to understand how deep the water is. So I think uh, it comes in very handy. And if you're a serious angler and uh, you don't wanna uh, leave the place without a fish in your hand, then I suggest that you um, get yourself a fish finder for your kayak. Number three, a crate or a storage container. As I mentioned, the Pelican Mustangs 100 Series Kayak comes with an exopod. It's a zippered container located at the back of your kayak. It's not very efficient for me. I don't want to unzip it and then reach out and grab the item that uh, I would like to pull out of that container. Uh, so as much as possible, I prefer just to have a crate where I, wherein I can see the stuff, the fishing gear that I need to use at the time. Um, so having a container or a, a crate uh, at the back of your kayak can come in very handy. So that is my number three must-have add-on. Number two must-have add-on is a side handle. The Pelican Mustang kayak has or have two handles, one in the front and one in the rear. That helps you pull your kayak or drag your kayak um, in every direction you want. But it doesn't have a side handle. A side handle allows you to position your kayak parallelly at the beach. If you are near the water and you wanna move your kayak, it, it allows you to uh, handle it, get a good grip of the kayak and allows you for a much more a smoother riding experience. Because when you're trying to get into the kayak and you don't have a good grip, then that may cause problems later on. And it also helps me get out of the kayak because I can just hold on that side handle um, of the kayak and uh, keep my um, balance well enough as I get out of the boat. Then number one, and this is something that you cannot go out of the water without it, a paddle and a paddle holder. So as I mentioned earlier, the Pelican Mustang kayak series does not come with a paddle. You gotta have uh, to have a budget for a paddle. There are many uh, manufacturers, paddle manufacturers out there. What I would recommend for you is to buy something that uh, one is going to last you a long time 
because that paddle will take much beating when you're out in the water. Uh, I also recommend that you get a paddle that will float when you drop it accidentally in the water because that will happen. The paddle that I have floats in the water. And also, you know, of course, if you have a paddle, you gotta have a paddle holder. Unfortunately, the kayak does not have a paddle holder. So there are inexpensive uh, paddle holders out there, anywhere from $10, $10 to $15 um, a piece. Uh, get yourself one, because that, that will definitely save you from dropping your paddle accidentally in the water. So there you have it guys that is my top 10 must-have add-ons for my pelican mustang 100 series kayak i hope you enjoy the video if you haven't done so yet please click the like the subscribe and the bell notification button so that you will get all the latest updates from my youtube channel kayak fishing with mark thank you all so much for joining me today i hope you have a blessed day Remember guys, keep those lines wet. I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.